Welcome, people. I'm here um, in a graveyard, of all places. I thought we'd go for a little walk. Um, a bit of a diversion, I know, but it should be fun. It should be fun, he says. It is raining. It is Scotland. So I'm here in the graveyard in Renfrewshire. And you can see there are graves. And obelisks and things. And, you know, it, it's all very nice. And it's all very well maintained. It's the graveyard of a church. Everything seems to be fairly acceptable. But I'm hearing today that Renfrewshire Council and Paisley um, are going to topple all the gravestones that are in a church, uh, that are in a graveyard because some of them may be unsafe. And certainly if we look at, if we look at these ones down here, you know, they're starting to, they are starting to, what would you say, peel away from the wall that they're beside. You know, so there's a certain degree of subsidence and this happens with gravestones. So rather than try and repair them, um, they're just going to topple them all down. And why would they do that? I mean, how, how would you feel if a gravestone of your loved one was going to be toppled over just because the council felt that it wasn't really you know, cost-effective to, to put any maintenance into a, a council-run graveyard. I mean, how much do they charge for a, a plot these days? I don't know. Um, so I just thought I'd come to a graveyard and see what's going on here. And there's a nice little stone there. That tends to indicate to me that that may have been a... Just stuff. Oh. oh dear, somebody's let their dog crap in the graveyard. That's just not nice. But kind of that's what this uh, society's come to these days, hasn't it? It's kind of become nobody cares. <laughs> nobody gives a shit, if you may. Pardon the expression. So people, people really, they don't look after things anymore. They don't care about things anymore. Although this, this place isn't too badly kept. Um, the grass has been cut. I think these gravestones that are in the ground, um, I don't know if you can see that one. So the gravestones on the ground, I think they've maybe been gravestones at some point and then they've been inadvertently toppled over and just left like that. Then again, I might be wrong. I might be wrong. We'll just go for a stroll around the church, shall we? Um, there's one that looks like a, a rook from a chess set. Yeah, there's, there's gravestones. There's quite a few flat gravestones here. Maybe, they, maybe they've done that deliberately um, so they could cut the grass. And here's a notice from Renfrewshire Council. Oh. Oh, and this maybe explains what's going on. So let's see, a five-year rolling programme of memorial safety inspections is due to commence in all Renfrewshire cemeteries and churchyards. These works are necessary to identify any memorial defects and ensure the safety of all cemetery users. Whilst memorials remain the responsibility of the layer owner, I love that word, layer. If during these inspections any memorial is found to be in a dangerous, unsafe condition, it will be made safe by the most appropriate method and the layer owner will be advised of this action wherever possible. Should you ask any further information regarding the inspection process, please call the cemetery office. And that was dated 26th of February 2020. So that, that pretty much ties in with what we were hearing today on the radio or the news um, about a cemetery in Paisley that was going to get all its gravestones toppled because the council had uh, declared that they were all unsafe. So rather than rather than notice people and tell them to fix their you know their memorials to their loved ones, um, they've just been toppled over and left. 
which seems to me to be a bit wrong. Coming live to you from the wilds of Scotland. I do this so you do not have to. Bye-bye.